Hey everyone, welcome to the video. If you're new to the channel, click the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you don't miss a video. And a lot of the videos I do are very entertaining for many people and I love to watch them. So why don't you just do it and join those that enjoy the entertainment? Less messages aside, let's just get into the video. So just yesterday, I came across this TikTok video where this man was talking about school rules and different things that are going on in school, seeing as schools obviously have been back now for a little while. Obviously, this, not this week, but next week is the final week before the first term or the half term ends. And obviously we're off then for a short break, only a week off for Halloween. And then obviously we come back afterwards. But this is what I found out when this man did this little clip. And I'm going to show you it right now. The wrong type of shoe on their feet. I even had a friend message me yesterday saying his daughter got put in isolation because she had Velcro on her shoes and not lace up ones. So, as you heard in that clip, there was one thing that really got me thinking. What the heck? When I heard that, I was like, are they kidding me? A student was put into isolation because they had Velcro on their shoes. And apparently they needed to have laces on their shoes. Does it freaking matter? Does it matter? Does it really matter what they have on their shoes? Velcro or laces, it shouldn't matter. So long as they are black school shoes, whether it's laces or not, they shouldn't care. They're sh school shoes. It shouldn't matter if they have Velcro or laces. Some students have difficulties with tying laces. Some students can't even bother to tie laces and tuck them into their shoes to make it look like they've fastened them, but they haven't. Many students in schools do have learning difficulties and other forms of difficulties that can either stop them from tying laces and have them struggle with it, or even just they can't be bothered and have a very bad attitude towards them. Some parents would say it is easier for their children to have Velcro on their shoes because it spends less time for the students to get ready. It takes some students longer than others to fasten laces on shoes. Which means then is killing way more time and sometimes it's caused students to come into school late because they struggled to fasten their laces. So some parents would accept the fact that their child should wear Velcro on their shoes because it's much easier for them just to slide their shoes on, put on the Velcro and you're ready to go. It's literally killing way less time than how it would take to fasten it. It's killing way more time for laces and less time for Velcro. So I don't know what schools are playing at saying that they should only have laces. It shouldn't matter what is on that school student's shoes. So long as they are completely black which is usually part of the school rules anyway. So long as they're black, laces or not, it shouldn't matter. They can have Velcro on their shoes, they can have laces. That's what happened when I was in school. When I was in school, I remember that for all my shoes, I had Velcro school shoes. Because in my youth, I had major difficulties with trying to tie my shoelaces, right? I, 
Right, these are my trainers, these are my trainers, right? They're fine, right? The laces, right? You're expecting a student to wear laces on their school shoes. Now, these are not school shoes, these are my trainers, but either way, right? You're expecting school students to have laces on their shoes. Not all students are going to manage to fasten their own laces because that's not how it works. I'm sorry, but like, do you not know how hard sometimes students find it to do things that they don't know how to do or they struggle to know how to do it? Well, they don't know how to do it or they struggle to do it, even if they've been taught how to do it. Velcro is probably the most easiest way to have shoes, right? I had Velcro myself in school. And I never once got into trouble for having Velcro on my shoes. I was never once put into isolation because I had Velcro on my shoes. It shouldn't matter. God, I don't even know what schools are playing at these days. Because these... Fix these fake schools are just getting to their heads. They think that they can introduce these stupid fake rules. No one even cares what rules they are. I don't care what rules they are. I don't care if a student has to have laces. If they're going to struggle with it, I'm just going to make them have Velcro. And if they've got a problem with it, if those students, if that teacher has a problem, they can tell the parents. We've got a problem with your child having Velcro. They might think, what the heck are you talking about? Well, I'm going to go into my own as aspects here. Now, side note, I don't have any children. At all. I'm still single. I don't even have... A partner with me at all but if I did have a child this is what I would do I would literally go up to that school and be a face to face with the head of the school I would literally confront them and be I'd literally ask them what they are playing about at when you're telling my child that they shall not have velcro on their shoes. Why is that a thing? Why do you think. They should have laces. What's wrong with Velcro. Because there is no problem. My child might have difficulties. With tying their shoelaces. What are you going to do about it? Exactly. Do it for them? Or should it just be easier for them. Just have a bit of Velcro on. So they can just quickly get their shoes on. And leave the door faster. To get to school early, so that at least then they're not getting any, like, detention or literal disciplinary points to their goals, right? How is it a discipline to children for, have, for having Velcro, right? It's not a disciplinary action. It's not a disciplinary action. How is that a form of disciplinary? You shouldn't be disciplined because you're wearing Velcro on your shoes instead of laces. It literally pesters me. I haven't done a bad schools episode in a long time. And th just this has me absolutely raging. This could be literally a crossover between bad school and rage fest at this rate. Because it's ridiculous. I would never, if I ever had a child, I would never expect my child to have to wear laces. If they struggle with laces, I would literally just tell the staff. I would literally tell any teacher, say, look, my child has extreme difficulties with tying their laces. So it was within my decision that they would have Velcro instead because it's easier for them. It shouldn't matter. Velcro or laces, it shouldn't matter. That's all I'll say. And I'll end the video right there. Thank you for watching. Because...
I'm done with this episode. And there's way more bad school stories on the way, so stay tuned. But until then, see you in the next video.